Tony Evans, renowned pastor, author, and theologian, has captivated many with his impactful sermons and writings, which focus on faith, family, and the Christian walk. Yet, in recent years, he and his family have found themselves in the public spotlight for reasons beyond his ministry work, specifically regarding his late wife, Dr. Lois Evans. This situation has generated discussion, speculation, and even controversy. Here, we'll dive into the life of Dr. Lois Evans, her profound legacy, and the reasons behind the controversy that has surrounded her and Pastor Tony Evans in recent times. A Legacy of Faith and Service who was Dr. Lois Evans? Dr. Lois Evans was an extraordinary woman who, along with Pastor Tony Evans, helped to build a ministry that would touch lives across the globe. Born on December 1, 1949, Lois grew up in a faith-filled household, and she married Tony Evans in 1970. Together, they established the Oak Cliff Bible Fellowship, OCBF, in Dallas, Texas, in 1976. Over the years, OCVF grew from a small gathering into one of the most influential churches in the United States, known for its commitment to community outreach, biblical teaching, and social engagement. Lois played an essential role in the church, working alongside her husband in various capacities. She was more than just a pastor's wife. She was a leader, a mother, and a mentor. She founded the Pastor's Wives Ministry and helped create the First Lady Conference, which provided resources and support to pastors' wives around the country. Her compassionate heart and genuine love for people left an indelible mark on everyone who knew her. The illness and passing of Dr. Lois Evans. In 2018, Lois Evans was diagnosed with a rare form of cancer. Her illness was a difficult journey for her, Pastor Evans, and their four children, Crystal, Priscilla, Anthony Jr., and Jonathan. Despite the health challenges, Lois remained a pillar of strength, continuing to support the ministry, her family, and her community. Throughout her illness, Tony Evans and his children frequently shared updates with the congregation and their followers. The Evans family's openness about Lois's battle and their unwavering faith inspired many. On December 30, 2019, Dr. Lois Evans passed away, leaving a legacy of grace courage, and unwavering faith. Her passing was a significant loss, not just to the Evans family, but to the entire community she had impacted. Controversy Surrounding Lois Evans' Passing Following Lois's death, a number of controversies emerged, revolving around theological questions, Tony Evans' public statements, and family dynamics. While some of these controversies were rooted in misunderstandings or theological differences, Others touched on more personal matters. Hashtag 1. Theological Views on Life, Death, and Healing One of the major sources of controversy stemmed from the Evans family's faith-based stance on healing and prayer. During Lois's illness, Tony Evans and his family publicly prayed for miraculous healing, sharing this prayer with their congregation and the wider Christian community. Tony Evans spoke about his belief that God could perform miracles, and that through prayer, the community could petition God for Lois's healing. When Lois ultimately passed, some individuals within the Christian community questioned whether the family's theology implied a lack of faith or understanding of God's will. Critics claimed that their public prayers for healing could have set unrealistic expectations, especially for those who believe in a specific type of faith healing. These comments sparked a debate within Christian circles about the nature of healing, God's sovereignty, and how believers should pray for loved ones who are ill. Tony Evans addressed these concerns by emphasizing that their prayers were expressions of faith and hope, not presumption on God's plans. He clarified that he and his family believed in God's ability to heal, but also trusted God's will, regardless of the outcome. This explanation resonated with many though some critics continue to question the theology behind such prayer practices. Hashtag 2. Public Statements and Messages After Lois's Passing In the wake of Lois's passing, Tommy Evans shared numerous reflections on her life and the family's journey through grief. One of his statements stirred controversy when he suggested that God might be calling home more individuals in the faith 
to fulfill his purposes in heaven. While some found comfort in the idea that there was divine purpose in Lois passing, others questioned the theological accuracy of the statement. The suggestion that God could be actively calling home people for heavenly purposes sparked a theological debate. Some Christians felt that this idea was speculative, lacking biblical support, and could lead to misunderstandings about God's role in human suffering and death. Others defended Evans, saying that he was merely offering comfort, and that his words, Pastor Evans later clarified that his comments were personal reflections rather than doctrinal statements. He emphasized that he was seeking to make sense of his own grief and offer hope to those who had also experienced loss, not to create a new theological doctrine. However, the statement continued to be a point of discussion among Christian theologians and laypeople alike. Hashtag 3. Family Dynamics and Public Scrutiny The Evans family has always been in the public eye, with each member involved in ministry and various forms of public service. After Lois's passing, some fans and followers speculated about the dynamics within the Evans family, particularly regarding the roles and relationships between the children and Pastor Tony. This scrutiny intensified as some members of the family, such as Priscilla Shirer, continued to be active in ministry, while others chose lower-profile roles. Priscilla Shirer, a popular speaker, actress, and author in her own right, had shared personal stories about her mother's influence and their close relationship. As Priscilla resumed her ministry work, some critics questioned whether the family was adequately grieving or if the Evans children felt pressured to uphold their mother's legacy. However, those close to the family defended the advances, explaining that continuing their ministry work was, in fact, a way of honoring Lois's legacy and the values she had instilled in them. The Evans family's resilience and commitment to their faith were often praised, but there was ongoing speculation about how the family was coping privately. Pastor Tony Evans, for his part, frequently emphasized that the family's public presence was not an indication of a lack of grief, but rather a testament to their faith in God's comfort and healing. Hashtag 4. Criticism and Defense from the Christian Community the controversies surrounding the Evans family following Lois's death drew mixed reactions from the Christian community. Many came to Tony Evans' defense, arguing that grief and loss are deeply personal experiences that should not be judged by outsiders. Supporters reminded critics that Pastor Evans and his family had been open about their faith journey, and that, as public figures, they faced challenges that most people would not understand. At the same time, some critics argued that public figures like the Evans family bear a responsibility to set a clear theological example, especially in times of crisis. This sentiment fueled debates on social media, where some individuals voiced concern over potential theological missteps or perceived inconsistencies in how the Evans family communicated their beliefs. Tony Evans' response to the controversy Throughout these controversies, Pastor Tony Evans has remained committed to transparency, often addressing questions and misunderstandings directly. He has used his platform to discuss the nature of faith, grief, and God's purpose, frequently sharing messages that emphasize hope and trust in God. By openly discussing his own struggles with grief, Evans has provided comfort to many who face similar challenges, even as he addresses questions about theology and family dynamics. In one memorable sermon, Pastor Evans shared that his journey through grief had deepened his understanding of God's comfort and provision. He expressed gratitude for the support he received from his congregation and followers around the world, affirming that their prayers had strengthened him during difficult times. His reflections have since inspired many, showing that faith can be both a source of strength and a place for honest questioning. Conclusion A Legacy Continues the life and legacy of Dr. Lois Evans, along with the ongoing ministry of Pastor Tony Evans, have left an indelible mark on the Christian community. Despite the controversies and questions, the Evans family's resilience and faith have been a powerful testament to the values they hold dear. While debates about theology, public grief, and family dynamics may continue, the positive impact of their ministry is undeniable. 
Ultimately, the story of Tony and Lois Evans is one of love, faith, and perseverance. They have navigated public scrutiny with grace, focusing on their calling to serve God and help others find faith amid life's challenges. Their journey offers valuable lessons on handling grief, trusting in God's plans, and finding hope, even in the face of controversy.